And we're gonna go. I need to check something quickly. Okay. Uh, still not showing up, by the way. Should be in your thing. Nope. All I see is a last and dink one. Give me a second, I'll do it again. Is it yep. there now? Now I see it. Awesome. Okay. Just need to upload something right quick. The Gadder's Garden. No, you. Okay. That is what I needed, so that should be good for now. Okay. What's this music I'm hearing? It's uh, oh, it's from last background time. background noise in this song. Okay. Kids don't drop that dent. No, I, I I listen to my own music, and in the song they have a club, and so you're hearing club music behind the bass song. I'm like, why am I listening to club music now? Why? Okay. okay. Oh. Try moving Ricks. Oh, oh, one sec. Uh, where are we? Yeah, I can do it. Awesome, we're good to start. So, you have multiple doors here. You have a place all the way uh, north and a place and two doors uh, Wes in the previous room. Oh, Jesus. Uh, yeah, there's, it's, it's a, it's a giant map. Where do you wish to go, guys? I say we go to Do you want Rix to just start randomly walking somewheres? I say Rix chooses. Oh, uh, it's just, that's a lot of spells. I say we go to Think about one. the most basic way for Rix to choose work. wisely. Okay. I feel like it's going to that's... go through this door, and it's going to just... Yeah, third yeah. choice. Okay. As usual. No, I do that. He looks through the door. <laughs> Just gonna continue through the door. Oh, it goes somewhere. <laughs> it actually goes somewhere. So, I'm not leaving until fucking eight o'clock. So oh, I'm here. Hi. Yes! <laughs> hey, Rix, I didn't have to actually. Don't worry, we are we were making sure Rix was played properly. Yeah. Rix is going to take a right, and you know it. Get <laughs> <laughs> that up. Why? I need a yawn. How dare you yawn? Yawn, bitch. Oof. This Look at you, you little Christian... bitch. Somebody likes you, you little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> bitch. <laughs> why do why people keep saying bitch? This is this watch. Send this to... Oh, man. Because you I don't give Marty Smith good grades, bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna haunt you in your dreams, bitch. Da 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 da. This is what I'm referring to. Wait no. <laughs> and then to ruin your days, I'll send you guys this video. Not my day. Oh no. I'm totally your day. He's ruining my day. Help me. My day has been ruined. Watch the video. <laughs> oh god. Watch both videos, actually. They're both pretty I, I think I'm gonna wait until afterwards. <laughs> That's not a good idea. <laughs> you want no, the best no, part? No. I, feel like, I feel like you would quote Huggy Wuggies. <laughs> I, I probably would. <laughs> Which I, one? I, I have a feeling I know what Huggy Wuggies is, and I probably would quote it. <laughs> 
Please give me Huggy Wuggies. Oh, oh yeah, no. Oh, what's this? Notices your bulge. Oh, wait, no. Oh, wait, that? Oh, yeah, no, I've definitely I played that before. I should have stayed home and played the new Call of Duty. This is so not cash money. This is so not cash money. This anyway. is so not cash money. That was That's the best quote in the entire thing. Anyways, other than that, <laughs> could you, uh, kind of say, wait, no. Hey, Jory. You're get, you're watching, if you're watching this video, somebody likes you, you little bitch. <laughs> Jory, if you're hey, here, have, have fun playing with and, this. And, uh, my daughter's character. I guess Zoan will be playing Marimont Mend because... Oh, yes, yeah, yes, <laughs> so yes, Zoan's yes, playing Marimont Alas, yes. wants to try role-playing as... God, no. God, no. Okay, make sure you at you... Make sure you make all the sexual jokes possible. That wouldn't work because Towards I'd be... Towards my dog's character. But, you yeah, know, if it was me playing, I'd have to try and keep on making things. Alas, I mean, what? dog, you need to learn how to roleplay. And you know I, I do. And you what roleplaying is? Don't give a shit, you're playing a character, not I know. yourself. This is how actors work. Yep. I know because I spent years in drama camp, that's probably the only reason why I don't oh give a shit about how people think of me when I do anything. Also, don't break the fourth wall. Is, is that like the same thing as bang camp? <laughs> there is no fourth wall in D&D, there's only the fifth wall. Which you can only break if you roll a 30 on perception check. What? It's, it's, a, it's an online... Oh! Oh! You can roll a 30 on perception check if you have if you have your stats rolled the correct way. But if you if you ever roll a 30 on perception check, uh, there was a joke online where somebody succeeded in doing that, and they uh, they snapped their character out of D&D into the real world, <laughs> and their minis were looking up at them. You see giants surrounding you, laughing and rolling dice. You were confused. Suddenly, you're back where you were. You have no idea what just happened. <laughs> what? Please say yes. that if one of us ever gets a plus ten to perception, that that will happen if we get a nat Only twenty. Only if you roll a thirty. That would well, be a yeah, plus it 10 would be plus a nat 20. twenty. Yeah, I know. Okay, who is the smartest uh, here? Uh, who has the best uh, wisdom? Um, it's probably even me or Rex. So, Rix, uh, you have walked up to a door. Yeah, it's literally me and Rix, I reckon. I will open the door. You attempt to open the door, nothing happens. It appears locked. I have a simple solution. Rix? Yeah, I will try again. Break the door. <laughs> you try to Is open the door again. Man? Um... Nope, doesn't work. Uh, Rix will knock. <laughs> you knock on the door. Somebody opens nothing happens. it. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> opens it. You hear nothing from the other side of the door. It's just there. It's locked. Okay, is anybody playing Marin? Rix walks down a hallway. <laughs> Rix, yeah. meant to. Rix walks away. Marin will go up and. Uh, Marin's blind. These tools, so. She should. She just, if she doesn't, we can automatically assume she does, anyways, because you start with them. I have thieves' tools as well. Uh, congratulations, you easily unlock the door and it opens, revealing... This room. Why don't you get natural 30 and these tools? Can oh, you break the lock? Uh, you just opened the door without even trying, and it just opens for you. I thought it was locked! Yeah, well I'm a wizard. It's not. You, stare, you stare at it, and it instantly opens. Yeah, you just cast, you just cast knock. You just will it to uh, open. Yeah, basically. Well, that's what Knock does. Oh. Knock um, magically opens locked doors. It's a, yeah. um, I'm good. I roll Intimidation while trying to unlock a door. <laughs> I get a nat, and I get 30. Okay, you intimidate the door open. I'm, good. I'm just gonna I'm just let, uh, let, let the other people go first that aren't the squishy rogue. So get in there, alas. <laughs> in their ass. It here goes uh, already low health. Uh, also not spent monk in the boy. Spell cast, low modifiers. So no one's in here, right? Nobody is in here. Sure, okay. all low health. I'm I'm just gonna try and open this door. Uh, it's locked. Okay. Uh that's a marm job, I guess. Everyone, get in the safety square. 
Marum successfully unlocks the door. She left the safety square. Have you opened the door? I would assume so. Okay, Marum also opens the door. Oh my god, it's just going to the other uh, room again. <laughs> oh no, it's a room. I'm gonna go in fast. You see nothing. You immediately just run in, and to your surprise, you see really ugly looking rats that are quite large. Sure. Oh, is there anything in there? Hey, what's in there? <laughs> I'm gonna walk up to it. Why and, are you uh... sounding like you want some cheese? You also quickly oh? notice that there's a curtain uh, connecting to another room. Curtain? Okay, I'm gonna just straight up attack this one. Okay, you run up and attack, everybody roll for initiative. Uh, or, uh, give me a second to clear initiative first. If you guys are ready. <laughs> Ooh. After we roll up. Everyone go punch some rodents. Wait, I'm not even... Whoops, wasn't selected on my character. The rodents got a 22. There we go, that took a couple... 23! <laughs> looks like... Uh, looks like we're doing second. <sighs> Has everybody rolled? Finally get an 18, and everyone else rolled better than me. Has everybody rolled? Yes. yes. Uh, it appears, awesome. No, Liam, Rick's got less than you. Alas, you go to punch. Punch, alas. Punch, indeed. Uh, uh we yeah. turned off turn order, we can't... Yeah, we Oh, lost. did I? My yes. mistake. Ah, uh, woo. What's it, a it rookie move, a uh, woo? Rookie move, a uh, woo. God damn the last punch! I'm, I'm punching uh <laughs> Nuzzles. Please give me huggy wuggies. <laughs> Ow. <Ow-oo. laughs> that 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 video. Why why is this where we're getting? A 15 to hit, you succeed in hitting a giant rat. Roll your damage. Yeah, you killed it. You just <laughs> it cracks in half. It's Did that roll okay, quick? suddenly music is placed. What the <laughs> Why does it roll two? Oh wait, no, it's because the second one's so the two hand. Yeah, I see. Yes. I- ignore me. Uh, okay. Right, so Extra attack. Any. Moving up. Gonna whack this boy. Moving up in the world. Moving up in the dungeon. Killing some giant rats. Making way down for the really dungeon. Like that. very dead. Take a roll and let me guess you killed it. Yep. Big shock killed it. It's dead. Very dead. It's I'm the deadest rat out I've ever seen. This. I'm just gonna scream. <laughs> Rats turn. Rats come out from the curtain to attack oh. you. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Oh my god. Yes, nibble me. Miss. Ew. Nibble me, daddy. <laughs> uh, they get advantage. Uh, miss. So... Miss, miss. Did any of those hit? No? Uh, absolutely not. Okay, this dungeon is gonna be easy from now on. <laughs> yeah. Marum's turn. <laughs> All right. You got. Ironically, you guys dealt with the big problem first, and now you're going and doing this. Which one was the big problem? The, the, the elementals. Um... Oh the yeah. Elementals. <laughs> you know the giant Jeez. balls of energy that live and like like to stick you in them. You know they just felt very uh element. Now oh, that's bad. The mind. <laughs> The air and water one, the one I kind of, kind of, uh... Erin's uh, gonna move up to here. And yep. she's going to make a uh, uh, short sword attack. Roll the hit. She hits and kills it. Oh, wait, actually, yeah, no, she's also it. using it's green flame blade. Right, so okay, now fire. she kills it. And the other uh, one also takes seven fire damage. Uh, wouldn't Marum be blind here? Uh, yeah, uh, no, she has night vision goggles. Oh, yeah, I forgot we gave them to her. So, uh, yeah, uh, how was that, boys? How do you like that fight? I'm gonna look into this room. Uh, when you walk into this room, what you see before you is the most magical room you've ever seen in your life. It is full of rat droppings. Everyone! (laughs) Right, I've got some (laughs) pee-pee. (laughs) <laughs> I mean, I'm sure Tori will make use of them. Whatever. What? I don't know. You're into rap jumpings, aren't you? 
No. <laughs> Sounds like a GoPro here. I'm going to go over token here. Just Not... runs uh into the corner of a hallway. Not token who most likely thinks they're chocolate. More hallway. I love hallways. Nice. I found a hallway. No shit, Sherlock. Dun 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 dun. Who's Sherlock? God damn it. I mean, he's role-playing better than you. He runs <laughs> down the hallway some more. Well, who's there? From his angle, he can very barely spot out that there appears to be a door right here. Guys! I found a door! Okay, I now he's just slathering it on like a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of what I'm going for. Liam, nobody asked for Should I open the door? Do, 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 do. I kicked down the door. You kicked down the door. Uh, I think you succeed. It caves in. And you get to see uh, an empty room with the curtain to your left. Okay. I'll last go in there. Sure. Let's go. I'm going through the- You immediately activate time. a trap and die. No, I'm being sarcastic. You, you just walk into the curtain. Just walk into a curtain. Nothing? Yeah, nothing from what you can see. You walk in further and you can see there's a door down here. Ooh. I'm gonna... It'll lead to the same place. I'm gonna call out that it's safe first off, just to let everyone yeah. know. And I'm gonna try and uh, knock down the door if it's not open. Uh, okay, uh, strength check. You fail to punch down the door. Ah. Seems reinforced. In a way. Alright, then get out of my way. Okay. You successfully unlock a door. Oh my god. Right. That's pretty door. Get in there. <laughs> Why am I meet you? <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> sure, I have a decent AC. Come on, we're going down the hall. <laughs> you, you I'm just going down the other hallway. You have successfully gone down the hallway. Uh, yes, token. I will reveal I would, more hallway. I would like to roll, roll for the hallway. <laughs> Rule for what? To continue going down the hallway? I yes. think you made it to the end. <laughs> Wait, is that literally the entire hallway? That's literally the entire hallway. <laughs> That's more of a cupboard. Guys, I found a really I'm, I'm long gonna, hallway. I'm gonna doubt that, and uh... uh by the way, before I forget, um, you guys just... have a uh, 100 XP from your last combat. Is that total oh, okay. or each? <laughs> That's total. <laughs> <laughs> That's 20 XP, guys. Let's see, 100 100 divided by 5, right? Dude, 20, come on. 20. You even for you. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, Rix, uh, you know, you've it's received surprising nothing. that I got into academic math. It is. Surprising that you have. Guys, come over here, I found more hallway. Yeah, Rix, yeah. uh, there's nothing there. I'd like to roll for this. Go ahead. Okay. Uh. Guys, come on, this is so much kind of money. Uh. That's perception. Who has the highest passive perception, by the way? Uh, mine is a 16. Yeah, same. 16. Oh, Such an okay. awful roll. Well mine, then, yeah, you notice nothing in that hallway. Mine. However, Mine's you a notice out of the corner of your eye when you're trying to leave that the wall over here seems a bit indented. Can I run into the wall? And token found a door. Ah, uh, okay, back. Another to door. That 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 room can be explored later. I'm gonna break it down. You punch down the door. Here's token. Uh. As it falls to smithers, you hear a demonic roar from the room. 
like you just pissed something off. Rattle the shit. Oh, f <sighs> what the fuck is that? I'm going to lift the door and put it back. You can't do that. You punched it right into the room. <laughs> oh, is that what you- Okay, okay everyone. Get I'm ready for a fight. I'm going first. <laughs> okay. Yep. Everybody, uh, roll for initiative first. Just kidding, man. And they got a five. We can't see the board. Oh, that's a good, bro. Twenty-two. Give me two shoes. You have awoken the slumbering troll. Just gonna. Is that everybody? Has it been ten minutes since our last? Uh, encounter? Like, uh, I'm not gonna say yes game. to that. Like, if you think about it, that's one, two rooms, and then like a short walk, and then a bit of exploring. I think it's been about five. I don't know. My five time. minutes, we already got into a giant fight. Wait, who hasn't rolled? Marum. No, that's not Marum. Uh, Tori. Yeah, I think it's Kian's character. His Discord is messing up. Oh, what a shame. I am very sad about that. He's got it. He's here. Okay. So, with that being said, alas, it's Discord your turn. Is there. Oh, yeah, sorry. Oh, I'm getting lost between pages. Blood. Oh god. Okay, I'm just gonna just step just to allow people to get in as well. I'm just gonna move over to here. God damn it, Jessica! Becky, how dare you do this? I was Jessica in the video I was referring to. Oh. And now I'm a wizard. How could this happen yeah, to me? That's such I a made bad my role. Mistakes. You got nowhere to run. Do I hit there? My gun goes on. Uh, you successfully hit. Wow, I was not expecting that to hit. Wow. You deal nine, I'm assuming? Wait, no, that's the wrong one. Yeah. Because then you I deal can nine do damage. Whoa. That's not the right one. I did not mean to roll that, ignore- Oh fuck, what am I doing? What are you doing? I meant to roll the second Game one, not the first hats. one, I'm sorry. Ignore the, the 27, even though it's a crit. So Why you would you ignore a crit, you fool? Just because, I, because I wanted the- <laughs> Wait, so? I, I don't know. Do what what one am I rolling? <laughs> Extra one. You've already. One more. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Congratulations. Ten more damage. Uh, I'll leave it there. Let the others do something. It's not happy with you, and it's going to take out its anger on the one who just rocked and punched in the face. Could we have talked to it? No. Uh, it makes yeah, it small yeah. attacks at both, you, both and then hits. goes to bite your head off. Uh, third one doesn't. You oh, take fuck. 14 damage. Yeah, I'm down. It's very far from you killing me, You guys successfully but... went to the other boss of the building instead of all the rats. You guys have been avoiding the goddamn rats. <laughs> Rix, it is your turn. Ah, uh, you don't have to worry. Alas, you'll be fine. Uh, Just eat some good berry. Uh, and now it is actually properly in my aura. So... Wisdom save. What? <laughs> oh, it fails outright. Yeah, it takes 17 radiant damage. It covers its eyes, it's being blinded. And, it is not uh, a happy troll. 
A goddamn troglodyte. Is it going if to only we had, If only we had bees. I guess I will also... Told the dead. That guy's really into that show. So that's another. Ba, 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 ba. He saves. All right. Uh, that'll be my turn, I think. Okay then. Tori, it's your turn. Okay. Okay, how am I going to do this? Because I can't really get to it properly, because if I do that, then I'll have a chance to be a hit, and I'll go down instantly, because I know my character's health. I would need to use my action to get past it. Uh, yeah. okay. Let's use instant transmission. I don't have instant transmission. <laughs> That's not a thing in D&D. Teleport is, but not that. Blink is also a thing in D&D. Slay the nerdy gurgy. Use my action and move here past it so I don't get hit. Okay. And I do not have anything for bonus actions. So, I will have to end my turn. Oh, I see. Actually, I'm going to drink a swift draught. Okay. Uh, Maram, it's your turn. My feet. <sighs> okay. Kind of wish Token wasn't there, but... Yeah, exactly. I can move. Oh, uh, it's not your turn, so you can't move. And I can move later, matter. but you're in my way, so I can't move. Uh... Marin's going to uh, take a dash and take the AO from the enemy. You sure it's a good idea? Because the monk just went down from his attack. Yeah, she'll be fine. I will be fine. She gets instantly killed. Uh, she can get to there with a dash, taking the opportunity. Uh, 19 hits. Alright, 13 damage. Mm hmm. And that's her turn. Okay. Token, it's your turn. It's May time. Can I dash, perhaps? Mm, I mean, you could, but I don't see why you would. Liam, you can just move to... Yeah, the, you, uh, move you won't take damage from that, Liam. Yeah, well, I'm going behind it. Yeah, but you're still you're next still to it. still within its range. Oh. Well, I'm going to stab it in the Achilles tendon. Uh, you attempt to stab it in the Achilles tendon. Roll the hit. Perfect. And twice, because I'm pretty sure this character has multi-attack. Like... Yep, he does. Uh, the second one hits for seven damage. Ah, uh, my Achilles heal tendon. Wouldn't it have Alas. disadvantage on movement? No disadvantage on movement. Wouldn't it have slowed movement? Maybe. Alas, it's your turn. Yes. Which means I need to do a roll. Ah, uh, for sake. No, I'm sorry, Alas. You're dead. <laughs> Wait, what? No, just continue. Just do your roll. You save one out of three. Oh. It is the troll's turn. Token, you know something interesting. What? The wound on its tendon seems to be healing. 
Hmm, aim for the nuts. So <laughs> heal and then hit. Hey, Blade Rocks. Before you get to do anything like that, it whips around uh, and makes a bite attack. Hitting. That hits. Who's Blade and, Rocks? Uh, and then is going to whip its arm and try to hit Ricks uh, for blinding him and get. Oh, oh no. Yeah, and get a crit. I'm and then down. token. Uh, token. Yeah. Uh, does that hit? What does? 18 does not hit. Why was I giving in front of him? Um, there's another mm -hmm. creature on the board. There is another creature on the board. Give it a second, though. Who's Blade Rex? Please tell me we do not also have to fight him. Just, oh, Blade Rex. Just wait. Uh, should be in here. That's a rare. Later, Axe, jump in and roll initiative. Uh, dude, you already have the link. <laughs> oh, okay, so he's joining us. A... He's been here before, he just... Just go to roll drop. 20, it's it's the uh, Sanctus map. Okay. I need to turn up his volume, because I can barely hear him. Yeah, he tends to be kind of quiet. Do so. As he moves his microphone closer so that he's not as quiet. <laughs> if you thought Dinkman Pinkman was a side character, wait till you meet this person. Or my dad's side I think character. I remember. Uh, no, not your dad's side character. In fact, your dad's side character isn't even made yet. Though I do have to sit down and get him to make that character at some point. I don't even think he knows he's meant to make a character. <laughs> Uh, well, you know, honestly, you guys are probably going to make it for him. I mean, I helped him, but he did ma mainly make his. What's, uh, mm. animal handling's, uh, bonus? Uh, is it wisdom? Yeah, it's wisdom. Huh? Did we tame this guy? No. All oh, right, Dahawk. That wasn't why I was asking. Can you tame the troll? Yeah. No. I don't want that to be 12, I want that to be 0. Stop trying to have exotic pets. You already have a dead cat. And see, see, this is why you don't get pets. You killed your cat. I only asked because I was doing weeks. something else and I was trying to figure it out. <laughs> I didn't expect I mean, to get one shot. Dude, it's a cat. <laughs> I know, after I moved, I realized how much health it had. And forgetting Ooh. that it was able that to That was damage. a dumb dumb of you, wasn't it? That was the dum dum, all right. That was the big dum dum. The last time I used a familiar, it didn't take very much damage. <laughs> Blader axe, roll initiative. Okay. Quickly add turn. Putting in a twenty-two. Uh, Wisdom. And we can let you go, uh, Jared. Uh, you hear chaos going ensuing down the hallway around a door, and you can see a prone kobold. Your immediate thought is that some adventurers are fighting a horde of kobolds or something, uh, and you go to check it out. Up. Oh, by the way, we're. Here on the map, that's your character right there. This is the first time I've ever seen you use an actual token for your thing. It is true. Uh, however, it's a lot easier than searching up for a bird person through this chaos that is yeah. the system. Mine was the closest you found to a bird person. <laughs> yeah, and it doesn't look a thing like you. Yeah. Mine's like a redhead, Rick's, for example. Rick's relatively looks like that, according to his photo. Alas, doesn't look like Alas, but then again, he didn't pick a character for later. True. Uh, I think it's fine. Marim, uh, Token. Yeah, Token's more or less fine. This would be, I think he's blonde. 
Token, token is blonde, has yes. no hair. No, token. <laughs> the carrier, the carrier that you picture me, it looks like he has hair. I mean, it looks like he's blonde. Yeah, the token is blonde hair. Also, token's not white. Hmm. Yeah, what? he's black. <laughs> We've, we've known that for a while, and Token, no, the picture I used to represent you is bald. No, it has blonde hair, I can see it. That's not hair. That's a tattoo. <laughs> Why? Dog, you just came in. Why? Because he's a tribesman. Have you never seen natives who have tattoos? Natives have had tattoos. Dog, what do you want? I think it's better to say because he's a Goliath and all the Goliaths have tattoos. That's, yep, yeah, that's even better. He's a Goliath. They all have tattoos. And they live in tribes in the mountains. And I'm black. So and how he's much black. Do I have to go up, Nick? Uh, do you see where I pointed on the thing? Did it move your mouse? I say, like, height-wise. Oh, how much air tight? Uh, in this hallway, it's about 10 feet tall, and once you get into the room, it's about, uh, 20 feet tall. Sorry, 15 feet tall. Didn't calculate that right. Uh, however, the doorway is only, like, an average height, so you won't be able to fly through the doorway. Okay. I've already tried flying. I ended up smacking my character's head on the ceiling. Down. You see the laying there dying kobold, and you see in front of it a giant ass naked green troll. Oh, that means Alas has it right in his ass, right in his face. Yep. Yummy. His token has his dick in its face. No, I'm not gonna agree with that statement. He's into it. He's into it. Is it <laughs> seen this, just like I've seen mega things. What is it even <laughs> trying to impress in casting? Did you just mockery? Okay. Okay, so you're uh, a bard. Click on click on vicious mockery. So he's a bard. Okay. Uh, I have to make a wisdom save. The troll is like, I got bigger schlong than you, and is uh, successfully not harmed. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, then you stress my move at the move there. Sure thing. Just like I say it in passing. Rix, you are dying. Oh. Rix, you are almost two. dead. Tori! Should... Your man Rix is down. In theory, you can get to him, but you'll put yourself right in front of the troll. This is going to right up his over. ass. I'm going to pour a health potion down his throat. Okay, roll the health. I'm just doing this so we can see how much I heal it for. Uh, since you're not 5th level yet, 2d8. Yep. 12 hit points, Rix. Then I proceed to slap him in the face to wake him up. Well, wake I up, wake up! Awake. It, it, uh, it auto-wakes you if you get healed. Yeah. Oh, okay. Did I miss something? Listen, roleplay aspects can be allowed. Then I am going to move here and hope that it doesn't hit. Uh, I recommend you don't do that. Wait, did I miss okay. something that I shouldn't have missed? Uh, I have gotten Rick's back up. Cause oh. got, at the somebody just up. showed up and tried to insult the thing Slong? Dong? What? Shlong? Shlong. Shlong. Is it Shlong, Shlong, Shlong? Ding Dong? Being bad about... Okay, Merim's turn. Merim is also wounded, but is still standing. Okay, she says, oh my. No, she's too busy concerned about her pregnant belly. And the fact her husband's down. 
Quote unquote husband. Oh, husband. No, not, not my side hoe. <laughs> I will collect all, all the right. races <laughs> and give birth to all the babies. Man will move to there. She's gonna she stab it with her animal? short sword. Mm-hmm. And green oh, flame oh. blade. Ooh. Sneak attack. Ooh. That doubles the uh, the green flame blade. Don't forget sneak attack. Oh, yikes. That as well, yeah. So, four fire damage instead of two, I'd say. Right? Or just roll another d8. Uh, Sure, roll another d8. And uh, roll your sneak Ooh. attacks. God damn. <laughs> So, so five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eighteen damage. Jesus, that was only one of his, their moves. I'm pretty sure they have extra attack. Sadly, the fire does not fly anywhere. Well, no, he, she's not high enough a level to have extra attack. Oh, okay. Right, because reasons. Sorcerer. And because I haven't used my second attack, I haven't used my bonus action. So, uh, bonus action true. disengage. Get the fuck away. Damn it, I forgot. Since you're, they have rogue, they can disengage. That's what they can do. Yeah. Token! Okay. You got a big burly guy on you. He's very Jamaican looking, and he's very naked. I'm going to say, get that out of my face, and I'm going to cut it off. Roll the hit. Oh god. The second attack misses. You deals 10 slashes of damage, ju- cutting off his junk. Can we please make it enraged? <laughs> sure, it's enraged. Alas, it's your turn. You are still down. Yep. Let me just roll. Oh! Oh, wait, that was his sword. I've waited Evan. If you can check your messages, that would be awesome. You fail once. You are one success, one failure. You're lying there dying. Oof. Hey, have you drinking a health potion yet? Selfira, it's your turn. Has the last drinking a health potion for me yet? No. Shove one of those down his greasy gullet. Wait till your turn. Selfira, it is your turn. Uh, I moved back up, walking through the doorway. Oh, I see someone's gotten rid of it. That's a shame that it's bleeding there. Let's see the burn is shut, and I'll use Sacred Flame. Sacred Flame, click it. On his, on his chopped off dick. <laughs> he succeeds in dodging. Your Sacred Flame. Oh my god. <laughs> This one said, what is this troll? Ah, get trolled, bitch! <laughs> Speaking of troll... Say I got about 5 feet... 15 feet above me? Uh, uh you got uh, 5 feet above you in this hallway. Okay. I'll take off, moving up 5 feet. He's just gonna sit there hanging up on the wheel at the ceiling. He can, it's if he wants to. Down this way. Okay, you're down the hallway flying. Got it. Uh, do you end your turn? Yes. The troll, very profusely. <laughs> its dick just spurts out. It's back. <laughs> it is not back. Why not? It took fire damage. No, it didn't. Oh, yes, it did. Green flame right. blade. Fire damage. I forgot about that because I wasn't thinking about that the right way. It's never growing back. It's not happy, so it's still enraged. No, no babies it... for you. You're taking two attacks, uh, 18 damage. Dog, stop complaining. Who? My, my dog. Yeah, dog. My stop dog. Complaining. Your dog is taking four attacks. 
No, you're taking four attacks. Three attacks, two attacks, whatever. Uh, cat. The dog just keeps whining at the door despite the fact that it was complaining about being outside, so it doesn't want to make up its mind. Is it a yeah, female what dog? Make up your mind. <laughs> hmm? What? That brings me to minus two. Token is down! That's what you get for cutting off the dick of a troll. That was Rix, very... you were up again. That was not very dang to the two of you. That was not very cash money! <laughs> Too bad for jury. Hmm. That he's missing this? No, but he has to go through this. <laughs> what? Never mind. Uh, oh, you mean editing it? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that makes more sense. All right. Uh, I think I'm gonna. I've already wasted my channel divinity on the last last time, so <laughs> yeah, it's the last down again. <laughs> yeah, I mean, to you, say, you, keep, again. you keep forcing so me to I'm go gonna, in uh, first. If you can manage to get this thing to not attack me, then I can. I am. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to. Uh... Do I have line of sight on token? Uh, yes, I'd say you do. All right, I'm going to. Uh... Oh, yeah, healing word, second. Get up, bitch! Uh... Wake the fuck up! Uh, you heal for seven plus, because I've got Two. Disciple of Life, should be adding a bit more, I think. Ah. Uh... Uh, one plus three plus three. And then also. An additional four from Disciple okay. of Life. Token, you are up with 11 hit points. Okay, I'm ready to cut off another one. And, uh... Aim for the neck next. I'm gonna risk it and try and crawl away. Uh... Okay. Main charm. Yep, the troll doesn't notice. It's still enraged looking at Token. Just moving out of its range. Right here, I guess. And that's my turn done. Okay. Tori! You gotta pour a You got poke somebody. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh... 2d8. You're up with six. So, yeah, you're up with six. You're currently prone. Token, you're also up, uh, but also prone. Wait, I'm up. Yep. Ooh. It's enraged, have... right? So I can try to move away. You hey, wait, which one do I put for prone? Okay, since it's enraged and focused on him, you try to move away and. It noticed oh. you! <laughs> It, it whoops me and it tries to chomp you. And it missed. Well, congratulations. You successfully got away from it. Thank fuck. <laughs> Maram's turn. Alright. Marin is going to, uh... Ah. I gotta check this real quick. I'm pretty sure that's what you put for not knocked prone. Uh, not working. What is it? Oh, it should be a saving throw. It is a dexterity saving throw. He has not set it up properly, so I'll set it to dexterity. Uh, I want to cast Burning Hands. Okay. Uh, it is a 15 foot cone. I'm sorry, he Alas. Fails. What? Uh, alas has to make the deck save because it's a 15 foot cone. Yeah, but I believe that Alas. Dexterity. Make the save. Oh, yeah, I should be fine. Watch him fail. 
Yeah. Oh, no. pass. Watch him fall. Watch I have a plus eight to dexterity anyway. Olympics. Uh, Saves. Olympics. Eleven fire damage on the on the troll. Arrgh, it burns. And because Alas is a monk, he can not even take half. He's fine. Yep. Token, you are lying flat on your gut with a troll who's really pissed off and has no schlong standing in front of you. Okay. Do, can I roll anything to get up? Uh, no, you use half your movement to get up. Okay, I'm going to use my movement to get up. Okay, you stand up. <sighs> You're standing okay. up. I say, you will hit like a bitch. Okay, just like roll one. to hit, I guess. You hit like a pussy and you smell like one too. Uh, both attacks miss. <laughs> damn, damn it. Your rolls are shit. Uh, <laughs> my insult lays on deaf ears. Yep, very deaf ears. Alas, we might want to punch Token out of this one. I'm gonna get up and uh, use my staff. Because why not? <laughs> You hit. One handed or two? Uh, one. I would recommend you move Maram out of 15 feet of me. Let's move him over a square. You go. And I'm Maram. gonna extra attack again. Extra attack. You hit. One hand again. Uh, okay. I'm gonna use a key. I'm gonna use a key point to uh, mm -hmm. use flurry hits. Eldritch punch. I don't have that. What? It's not a thing. <laughs> I was really confused when you said that. Uh, so yeah, I get two unarmed strikes. Yep. You crit hit. <laughs> And you, uh, you punch right through its chest and rip out its still beating heart and squish it and it falls over dead. Oh, okay. I was going to use, it, um, Burning Hands. It only hands. had one hit point left, so, uh... Oh! Jeez, I'm so low after that. <laughs> Congratulations, well, you, you guys potion. just got 1,800 experience divided amongst the six of you. How much was it? 1,800. 1,800 divided by 6. I believe that's 300. 330. Oh, yeah, 30. I said it wrong, yeah. I said it wrong. <laughs> you all get Boy, 30 what? XP. <laughs> 30? I literally, have, I literally have 6 hit points left. Congratulations. Yeah, that's from me. <laughs> As you take a look around the room, you realize the troll had some shit. What kind of shit? It's kind of sprawled all over the place. Does it smell? Uh, yes, it all smells. Oh. <laughs> uh, does anybody want to like scavenge through all the dirt in the room looking for stuff? I will. It's a very smelly sure. room. I will warn you though. I the will. only person you can probably stand this room without thinking disgust is probably Rix. I mean, yeah. Um, I will plug my Rick nose. Rix is fully it. willing to search through piles of shit. Rix, you start searching through piles of shit. In the process, you find uh, sixty-four Absolutely pieces. nothing. It's absolutely jack. <laughs> you lose some stuff to a mess. Can I also search it? You lose your weapon. Uh, can I also you search the pile? How about you let me just read off what you guys find? Is that good for everybody? Yep. No. There you go. Yeah, no, sixty-four open. copper pieces. Fifty-three silver pieces. Four gold pieces. One book chronicling the lineage of Grenver, a minor noble family of the area. One book on elementary mathematics. Both books are worth 25 peaches, pieces each. This page four. Pieces of gold? Yes. Okay, wait. It was 64 copper. Yep. How much silver? 53. 53 silver. 
You said four gold, right? Yep. Four gold. One book chronicling the lineage of the Grenver uh, Nobile family. And one book on elementary mathematics. Uh, Rex is going to claim one of the books. Which one? Uh, it doesn't matter because he can't read. Uh, sure. Yeah, he takes the book on Grenver and leaves the others with the book on elementary mathematics. I have a question. If, um, with the book of mathematics, could I use that to enhance the strength of my flames using things like knowing how what fire is made out of and concentrating more oxygen into it? First off, that is, uh, that's chemistry, not mathematics. Second off, <laughs> elementary mathematics. This is one plus one equals two kind of stuff. <laughs> I think Carl, I think Token this is needs stuff, that. This is stuff that would only affect Token and uh, and Ricks, maybe. Token, token needs to, it. Wait, wait. Let's give the mathematics one to Ricks then, so he can start learning how to actually count. Ricks can't read. <laughs> but Token can. He can? Yes, he's Token. Sunseeker, uh... bitches. Fine, he can okay. read. Alright. We're not giving you a mathematics book. <laughs> I'm going to start reading it. I said we're not giving you it. Why? How much gold was it worth? 25 pieces. Okay, yeah, that's just how much that book is worth. All books are worth 25 pieces. At least oh. these ones. You find right. eight blue stones. Uh, one strange looking stone. And one potion. I'm going to pick up the strange Ooh. stone. Excuse you? Rick's still in looking. And if, Don't give uh, a shit. What, what does the, sto the strange stone look like? Is it like sparkly? Is it glowing of any kind? Would it catch the eye? Uh, yeah, it's kind of like a, a whitish brown with like a, a glossy stripe pattern going through it. I ask, I yeah, ask Rick's um, would absolutely be collecting that. I asked Rick a funky looking stone it. that's really smooth and uh I asked Rick if I could see it. And you find <laughs> another uh, 10 stones that also look like that but instead of brown it's like a bluish color with like white stripes going through it at spots and little dots, uh... you know. Rock layers. I asked if I can see them for something but I will. Uh Rick hisses at you and he scoops them up and scurries off into a corner with <laughs> Okay, I'm going to grab to one of the rocks from from uh, Rex. Yeah, you slide uh, a piece of What I am going to do is I cast Goodberry. I'm gonna what? toss three of them at Token, three of them at Alas. Uh, I'm gonna keep three of them for myself. I'm gonna give the last one to. How much health does Tori have? Uh, Tori currently has 25 out of 36. Okay, I will give the last one to you. Uh, we all... So, uh, Tori, you heal for four. Alas, and Token, you heal for twelve, if you eat your berry. There's still a potion sitting over in the corner. Yeah, it's beside a, potion, a puddle, guys. though. It's beside uh, a puddle with a squishy-looking substance, and it smells like shit. And um, don't waste your spell slot because it's not a spell slot. It's Rick's a was cantrip. he was going to take a seat in this corner and it's start cantrip. ritual casting detect magic. It it's a cantrip. Oh, could oh, I see. search the shit? Uh, sure. I have I have um, identify and detect magic as cantrips. I say without them noticing, my eyes flare up with a match. I just hand. realized. Wait a second. Okay. Who's that other bird person? You see, besides the poop pile, is a potion of invulnerability, Blader Axe. Uh, Celephira. I quickly go and grab it. I rolled a 10. I don't think you know that. But do I roll five, a you? sleight of hand to see whether or not they notice? Wait. Would he even know it's a potion of invulnerability? Yes, he just casted uh, Detect Magic on it. That's me. <laughs> With you guys were arguing. That was me who casted that. Yeah, but he told me without them noticing, your his eyes flare up. You guys were still arguing oh. about it when he said that to me. Uh, he got a twenty-three slate of hand. Does anybody want to make an insight check to see if they notice him uh, grabbing the potion? Sure. 
Where's inside? You do not notice. Do I notice any other magic sense senses or anything in the room? Uh, you do see a, a magic sense coming from the bird man. Uh, some equipment on him. But uh, because you didn't see the sleight of hand, you assume that it was on him already. Hmm. What about the stones? Uh, there is no magic coming from the stones. They're just okay. pretty. Stones? <laughs> They're just stones. Is there, there anywhere else in the room that has magic? Vulnerability neck? Uh, mm hmm okay. Yeah, potion of invulnerability. Anyway, I, I rolled a 10. What do I find in the poop? Uh, you find rat bones. Guys, I found rat bones. I'm going, Why are I'm you going to touch it. <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to tap on uh, Tori's shoulder. I just noticed that someone hosted me. I hold on. I'm gonna roll an athletic check to up? avoid his hand. Uh, sure. Go ahead. Would it be acrobatic, actually? Athletics. Okay. Uh, you get poop smeared on your hand. The noble family. I just uh, Rick has like... the book of the noble family. Hold on. Would. Wouldn't he be over oh, there puking from anything. digging through the shit? No, because Token seems like a guy who can tough it out. I just play. Look at, I just look at my shoulder with a look of disgust and look back at him. What's you burn your robe in disgust. Wrong? Are you sick? I'm gonna put my hand on his head. Seeing if he's sick or not. Can okay. I please use? Can you I sure. please um? You sure? Hold on. You can use acrobatics. You can do a backflip to get away. <laughs> That's not what I was gonna ask, but okay. <laughs> I was gonna ask if I could use Firebolt and just burn it off of me. <laughs> you say, you get guys are battling right over your head. Yes. I approach so a cowboy in an attempt... In an attempt to make conversation. But more so to see if I can get the book off of him. Okay, you guys can start a conversation. Wait, he's trying to steal my uh, book? No, you're not a kobold! I didn't hear kobold. Why would he give a shit about elementary mathematics? Um... Is it, they have no- Nick, they have no idea who I am. I thought he was talking about the stuff. I know, they have I know that, but still, who on earth would give a crap about elementary mathematics? Anybody in-game who would need it would not be able to read the book firsthand. I... I thought that, that he meant, I thought he was talking about the Arabin spellbook I have on me. Oh, he has no clue about the Arabin spellbook, or no, uh, maybe he does because it's glowing. But he would assume yeah. that it's your. It's he would assume that it is your spellbook. I'm having an issue. What is your issue? Uh, it's not to do with the campaign, so it can win. Too many uwus. No, I'm I'm trying to deal with NPCs in my one. No, I can't enough huggy wuggies. <laughs> no, I'm I'm trying to figure out my one. I just can't figure out how to add spells to the NPC. Uh, for your campaign? Yeah. Uh, the same way you would do it with a character, you open up. It, it doesn't. The it doesn't. Give uh, no. A list. When, it when you set up a character as an NPC, uh, you open up the options for them, which lets you put right. on all like the uh, race what? and like size and stuff. And at the very bottom of those options, there is, I think, a checkbox. Yeah, there's a checkbox for spells. Let's you set it as a spellcaster. Oh, no, after you do it. <laughs> should we take? It's should we board ass. off this room a bit and take a little? Actually, we shouldn't do it in this room because it's full of shit. Yeah, you guys should take a long rest. You guys been down here for a while. It's been a long day in the sewers. Uh, Selfira has also been down here for a while. Not going to mention why she's in the sewers. She, he, what's her name? What's her gender? Male. Question mark. Uh, why he's in the sewers? Uh. You guys he have no idea who he is. Because he has a name that sounds extremely feminine, like my character's name. Yeah, you guys have a tendency to pick female-sounding names for male characters. If only they've never done that twice. Because they're weebs. Why was randomly generated? <laughs> I just went with it. His was randomly generated in-game, and we are like, yeah, that's a pretty cool name, we'll go with it. Yeah, mine's just Tori, I chose that myself. What was your other character's name that was really feminine? Um, Sabrina. Sabrina Why did you English. give a male the, the name Sabrina? I translated silver a few times in different languages. It came out as Sabrina. Uh, uh, 
God damn it, kid. <laughs> Had you never heard the name before? No, I knew it was a feminine name, I just thought, eh, fuck it, it sounds close enough to a name. <laughs> Close enough, it is a name. Yeah, if you, 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 you want to make, a, you wanna make a, good, uh, a good name using just translations, always just go for Latin. Yeah, Latin's the best choice. No, no, Let me like, tell you, all the gods, like five different all, languages. All the gods in the Breviary are literally Latin-based names, except for maybe some of the demigods and lesser gods, because a few of them uh, are Japanese. A character that I have just That's made the name. recently. Uh, his name is Aestus, and he is a summer Aladrin, and his name is literally Summer in Latin. Nicholas. My name is... Yeah, yeah, that's just something that you come and see. Take Lucifer, for instance, the god of light. It's literally just a light translated in Latin. Ever heard of Sabrina the Teenage Wizard? Shut up, Oliver. Did he just make that reference? Movie. It's a really bad show, is what it is. Did he just really make a Netflix show reference? How dare you? No, he did not. First off, Sabrina the Teenage Witch is not a Netflix-only show. It was originally an Archie comic. I know it was. Second off, to make fun of you, he called her a wizard. <laughs> My character is a... Well, You're a character. wizard, Harry! You don't get the... <sighs> Anyways, back to game. Go find a room to sleep in. You guys need a rest. And not the room filled with shit. Okay, the room next to room full of shit. Let's go to this yeah. room. Okay, you go to that room. I like the room where we're in with a door oh, that we can shit. walk in to keep ourselves safe from anything else in the sewers. It's full of shit. We couldn't just don't, sleep don't, in just that don't, room. Just don't sleep next you to the shit. You always pick this room and this room because, you know... Yeah, I'd say we room. probably should... They, Pick a room that's safe. If we go into and, that and, room, and plus, really be able to... uh, Rix, that door, you can't lock it. It's off the hinges. Alright. <laughs> Somebody had a little too much fun. Check up in room 14. Okay, so I get all my spell slots back. That's good. Not gonna lie, the, the room numbers mean nothing. I, I literally... I, I generated it and never used the, uh, the generated quests. Is it making this a long or a short rest? Is it I recommend take all? your time and make a long rest. Is it while we're here and moving? Can you just drag me over there because I'm currently. Away. We have all the health back now, right? Because like it's a long rest. With this Colboid. Colboid? <laughs> Does I your character not know what a Cobol is? Oh, Cobol. So who are you? I can ask you the same. That's okay. I'll ask, and I'll ask you again. Okay, I was not expecting to get your name that fast. He's I not. Look at, I look over him and say, "He's an idiot. Don't worry." Now, what's your name? My name is Safira. You are you a male? I'm totally not Russian. <laughs> are, are, are you, are you a guy? French? The fuck's with your name? You're a guy, aren't you? Yes, I am a guy. Oh wait. Oh. I'm more man than you. <laughs> What's <laughs> <boy? not>. <laughs> Dude, I'm making sure during a long rest, we're gonna all our back, right? It's a what? Another that during long rest, we get all our health back, right? Yeah. But I can't hear you. Speak up, sunny boy. In order to. Change my name. I'm going to need the, the information which is held within that book you picked up there. Mmm, no. No, 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 you're not getting that. No. I just deception need to read check. it. I can read it up to you. Uh, roll, roll no. You gotta roll a deception check, Jared. <laughs> Uh, I can't beat that. <laughs> Even so, it's a quiet. <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, I only have a six in my insight, so that's I'm not going to be beating that. However, I am quite the idiot. <laughs> you went look, and uh, and he pulls out not the book that he just collected, but oh, a prayer book. <laughs> 
not that book. The, the other book. Yes, Rex, give him that book. Give him that book, Rex. I look at Thank him and you. say, Hey, this one suits you more, and pulls out the basic mathematics. <laughs> what, for I Rex or for the I word? Wasn't to, I wasn't about to quote the story and tell you. I'm Get used. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. But okay. They call yeah. it with the basic mathematics, which is like, okay, why don't you tell me the square root of 547? How about you give me. <laughs> how about you tell me what 2 plus 2 is? Hold on, hold on. I'm that is simple. That is for what? You don't know basic math I'm yourself. 23.38. Hold on. I just like to point this out. This is basic math. Like, you already pointed it out to me. But. This is basic mathematics, and he's telling me it's on the square root of something. Yeah, he knows advanced mathematics. <laughs> also, <laughs> apparently it's not a characteristical trait. Apparently Rix knows advanced mathematics. <laughs> he's like, okay. He's like, very good. Do you I know, know say, How the fuck do you know that? <laughs> do you know I'm Marius making benches and you know that. <laughs> I don't even know that. <laughs> Oh wow. Uh, oh, yeah. What the fuck is a square root? <laughs> I would say Rix is a is a very trusting fellow. So he will hand over you the, the uh, hand over the book. I just thought of something. Blade Rex. With with square root even exist in this time. Math is constant amongst all dimensions that base themselves in reality. Therefore, yes, math would exist in this universe. No, a not that. Root would exist. Would it even Say be called it square the... root? Yeah, as I was asking. Can you tell me the title of the book again, Nick? Yes, you look at the book. The title of the book is, or well, fucking, I don't actually have a title per se, but it's the, uh, it's a book on the lineage of the Grenver uh, uh, noble family. Okay, thank you. Do you do you recognize that noble family? I have listed in my inventory strange stone. What the hell is that meant to be? Uh good question. I wouldn't remember, apparently. You've had it for a while. Oh it wait, no, that was that was, like, no, I wasn't even this campaign, so no, I don't know what the fuck that is. Well, then you can get rid of it if it's, there's nothing to it. Yeah. Depends, I got that at the same time, I got a bottle of ale. I have a oh, ring of protection. Uh, wait, I think that was an elemental gem, but I forgot to actually do anything with it. I have oh, one but ring there's of There's only been one elemental gem in the entire game, and you guys have to answer your question. I have no clue what the fuck yeah. this is. Yeah, let's get rid do, of it. You do? I do. Is it relevant to your character, though? Minor. Minor. Figured. Figured. Because, uh... Yeah. As you flip through the book, you get a general sense of the noble family. If you if you want to tell it to the others, it's your choice. And if you do choose to tell it to the others, I will tell it verbally. Otherwise, I believe I've told you in private about this family. Whether you remember or not right now. It's a side thing. Yes, sir. Since I did say I would read it, I would say I say this knowledge to Rix. Okay, to I Rix, you I would read it to him. Okay, to Rix, you tell him the Grenfer family was a noble family that used to uh, live and run the town of Aerith as a small baron. Sorry, Viscount. Uh, inevitably, uh, years later down the line, uh, one of their descendants who came in possession of the manor went insane, uh, killing several people and living in the tomb that lies under the manor, where his deceased wife and child were. Uh, the family is now dead, uh, and has lost their rank as far as everybody knows. Yep, and that's about the gist of it. Yep.
All what right. does a spell major image do? <coughs> it creates a major image. Uh, I hope you know that the, the notes for that are going to be atrocious. Probably. It was really given bare minimum. It was given to Ricks. Concept. So it's going to be how Ricks remembers it. And it smells like shit. That's fair. Hey, hey, uh, Nick. Why does it smell like shit? Oh, well, the book. Oh, I thought you meant the book. Hey, DM. Yes. Did you forget Why do I have a ring name? of protection? No, he, he said that. That was your story. reward from the goddamn slaying of the goddamn monster that nearly killed all of you. Oh, you already increased your can things, I attune to it then? It's You're already good. attuned to you. What does it do? It gives you a higher AC. <laughs> I'd be at 20. No, you'd be at 19. My, my thing was 19, 19 before. You already raised it, Liam. No, it was 19 before I even raised it. it. already raised it. We raised it for you. When? When we started this campaign, my, uh, my AC was 19. No, it wasn't. It was 18. <laughs> it was 18, you fool. No, you're a fool. Let me see. It is equipped. It's giving you a plus one AC right now and a plus one to your saving throws. What? It's it's currently in effect. It's forcibly changing your armor class to 18. Watch what happens when I unequipped it. This is strange. No, it's really not. You're just not really understanding it. And when do I understand anything? No, no, you wouldn't. You've okay. The day is multiple times today. You guys have a long rest, and it's hold, the hold, hold, on, hold on. Okay. Yep. I thought we did give token nineteen AC. We did. Yeah. Because he uses a done. shield, and he uh... has chain, right? And he also has defense, which would have given him nineteen AC. Yeah, he has nineteen. That's his fighting style. That's a fair point. So exactly. If anything's going to give him more, then he shouldn't be over. 19. Then that's probably because uh, the fighting style does not forcibly override your armor class, so I have to go and forcibly change it to 20. Uh, give me access to his sheet. I can set it global for you. Uh, token. Edit. Wow, I'm surprised you don't already have access to a sheet. I'm also kind of surprised about this. There you go, it should be in your inbox now. There you go, you found one of the treasure troves, the shit show that was the Troll's Den. And then you prevented it from regrowing its dick. Congratulations. <laughs> oh, right, I was gonna grab dick its dick troll. and then keep it and sell it later to a single mother. Yes, uh, I how about no. Dick. no. Nick. Yep. Due to my background, would I know if the guy if the guy is actually still alive? Uh, you know that the guy is not alive from that family. There may be remnants of the family around, but they're no longer recognized as nobility, and they have not been for a few generations. They would be commoners now. It's a fallen noble house. I'm talking about the... Ward who turned into the crazy murder. What I know of. Oh yeah, alive. him. He's still alive. Oh, he's still alive. I feel like getting stinking cloud, just for the sole factor of, um, of um. You're uh, constantly Rick's shitting yourself. Can walk through it like nothing is wrong. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Rick's walk through stinking cloud. Hmm, smells like home. I think you mean it smells like my pet. No, it, it would smell worse than your pets. <laughs> I was thinking it smelled like sulfur. Right. It smells like rotten eggs. Yeah, it smells this like is... sulfur. 
components a rotten egg or several skunk cabbage leaves those are a thing cool. apparently i mean I'm by the way sure Rick, my, my my pet does smell worse than that by the way it Rick's is house just your, a flat out skunk i just realized skunk he's had doing... this skunk with us the entire time yeah there's a skunk in his backpack yeah uh, it's in the cage would we be immune to smell by now? No. It's 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 very unpleasant to travel with with Ricks currently. Yeah, because we've been exposed to this for long periods of time. No. Okay. Long rest has ensued. You guys regain all your spell slots and hit points, and you regain two of your hit die for the day. Oh. I'm able to use Fireball again. And Anmate dead. I already so, have outside of your current quarters, there's a secret door that Alas hadn't noticed. And then, if you continue going past the Troll's Den, there was more hallway. I if say we go, go to back, the one near. I say we go to this one. If you go back, there's plenty of other doors along the ways that you have stumbled across. And you don't know about that, Tori. Oh, I thought you I was, I told, it already. I was the one who mentioned it. I never told you guys. Sorry, sorry. I never told you guys. Um, however, I will get out of the room and head over to the crumbling wall. Or dented wall, sorry. Uh... I guess roll strength to try and knock it down or open up. Uh, sure. You punch the door and it just opens. Okay. It's not like it was locked. Oh, cool! Everyone able. Would you think the stinking cloud? <laughs> Nick? Yep. Would you say that the, the stinking cloud spell would be flammable? No. Nope. Damn it. If it was flammable, then I could just set it on fire. <laughs> I'm very aware of what you would do if it was flammable. Are you guys going to go down the hallway? Yeah, I was just making sure everyone was coming. Everyone's there. You know, I just realized I shouldn't be the one standing next to him. Somebody else go in front of me. <laughs> hmm? Somebody who's not a spellcaster go in front of me. And they a movie character. <laughs> this is a long hallway. I'm on my way. And I'm on my way. I don't know where I'm going. I'm on my way. Uh... Wait, everyone to catch up first. Uh, let's go up first. We're missing somebody, aren't we? Yeah, we're missing somebody. Yeah, we're missing. The bird has wandered off. Bird boy's gone. Bird brain, where'd you go? I said, I'm still f falling behind. No, you're not. He's there. Oh yeah, okay, he moved. He's invisible. No, I'm just up flying above you guys. Now we just kind of missed a room. No, I, I've tried to fly in this area before. It's 10 feet tall. Oh, okay, it's taller? In the hallways. You can't fly through doorways, I tried that. I accidentally missing every room. <laughs> Please move off my token. I'm not trying to open this token. Just perch on his shoulders. Open sesame. You open the door. Aww. Is it the second troll? <laughs> it is the second troll. Nah, just kidding. Well, I'm healed now, is it? Piss poor, unhappy cultists. Oh, I, I think oh, they killed our brother. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's got it. Go back to what you're doing. Close the door. Okay, I'm gonna run in and Good. straight up attack this cultist. Give me a second, I need to set some things up. 
There's Namely, two. four cultists. Should I make another flaming sphere on top of them? Dun 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 dun. Banana, banana. Are you using the same turn order? Uh, no. I will reset the order. Uh, remove all turns. Yes. Oh no, they have found us again. This is for Joseph. I've been getting so many good initiative rolls today. Yeah, you have. I think you've gotten in, I think you've gotten crits multiple times. I think I've critted twice on initiative. Well, the cultists got a crit That's as well. I crit on that deception roll. You did. Meanwhile, Token has missed all of his attacks. <laughs> That's a six. Okay. Oh, Christ, Merit has assassination. Do you need yes. to Why the fuck haven't we been using that? Because Merrim is stupid and has fire hands. Oh my god. What does assassination do? A free advantage if, if the other things yeah. don't attack first, and what if we the surprise hell? them with auto crits. What in the hell? Jury. <laughs> Boy. How often do you guys actually get surprise on the enemy? Like, never, to be fair. Like, he exactly. was actually, you know, stealthing and doing it properly, he could probably get surprised a lot. Mm -hmm. He could turn invisible for free, for God's sakes. That is true. That is very true. So can I, but... Four I times a day. Or was it three times? I forget the number. It was 17. Three. It was not 17. <laughs> it was three. Yeah, three invisibilities per day. A I mean, I demo been... ring of greater invisibility. I can turn him invisible. Oh, it looks like I'm first. Oopsie poopsie. Liam, you're last. Second last. But look at that type of the Turner order. Because he hasn't yeah. sorted it yet. Bum ba dum bum ba dum. Alas, go punch something. The last punch. Yeah, I'm gonna use the staff of special. The giant burning lizard looks really unhappy with you guys. <laughs> you hit! I crit though with that first roll. Doesn't what die? First roll? Be no, down the draw. Oh. Okay, I'll whack him again. with 28. I'll whack him again. Whack. I'll give him the good whack. Crack is whack. Yeah, crack his white kid. You hit him again. He is still standing. You got to do better than that to keep oh, me. Oh, I forgot these guys oh. actually had health. <laughs> uh, I'll end my turn. The filthy no, rats that go living down here. We need to get through. You can't get through from that position. He has either his right and his left open. Mm -hmm. He is not blocking the door. You can't walk around beside it. Yeah, that one. Well, I'm move honestly one treating square. them as soft corners. I don't want to move over one square. I mean, you're blocking the door. You can get through either side of me. <laughs> as Nick pointed out. Oh, with that, do you end your turn, alas? Yes. Ah, oh, we'll show you this is for Joseph and Brian. Jesus. Brian was a little bitch. Makes miss, two attacks miss. against you. Both of them miss. And the other one. Uh, casts this whole person upon you. Oh no. Do I have to do a wisdom saving throw? Yes. E Rex. Do I pass that one? Uh, what? Do I pass it? Uh, yeah, I think you pass it. Yeah, you pass it. Cool. Okay. With that, it's Tori's turn. 
Okay, I'm gonna drink. I'm gonna use my bonus action to drink a swift strut. I'm gonna use my bonus action to drink some troll's blood. I'm going to move here. Are you actually going to try drinking troll blood there, Token? No, why would I? Because you're insane. I am insane, but I'll probably drink cultist blood. And I'm going to use... Or bite into a cultist oh. neck. I'm going to use burning hands. Okay. And I'm going to use my other things to go with fire attacks. And These I'm going passes. to use it. Is that a baby dragon? What is that thing? It's a lizard. Salamander, what? probably. Should I make it so that's burning, or should I make the other two burn? Make the other two. Burn. the other two. I would say the lizard looks strong. I say the other two. If it's a lizard, then it's most likely has resistance to fire. Lizards also burning. Also, alas, you'll need to make the check as well. Go for it. Uh, what's would... what's the check for? Wait, would they? Would he? No. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh. Okay, I'll ignite the cultist if he's right in front of me. And since I have elemental, is elemental mastery doing it? No, but it's one of my abilities. Which one is it? I think the cultist uh, succeeded in a saving throw. He takes half damage. I guess. So he would take 3.5, but I'm guessing we would just be 3. Uh, for Ignite, he'd take even less. Because hmm? he's yeah. only taking half damage from your burning hands. He'll be taking one damage on his turn. You uh, use Intensify Elements to attempt to uh, Wait, when burn be the Salamander. Them? Uh, when you're doing that, snap to a corner, and it'll be 15 feet in front of you. This guy's not in front of you. Okay. Oh my god. You try well, to burn it, they... your fire is not affecting the lizard. Well, I was using Ignite on the, the other guy, but when... Wait, so the lizard didn't even need to roll a dexterity, so it's immune to fire? Yep. I'm guessing that intensified element doesn't do anything against that? Nope. Notice how it says resistances, not immunities. Oh, yeah. I just play and yell over, We're screwed! <laughs> Why? What'd you see? Well, this thing is immune to fire! As long as it's a giant blue lizard, we should be fine. Maybe you can't see it, can he? No, we can't. I can't. Just making. I just making a. Uh, Sulfira. A joke. You know, I haven't thought of using arcane recovery at all. I really should have, but I haven't thought about it. And I'm going to end my turn. Good to know. <laughs> So Sapphira, or Jared. It's Bird it Brain's turn. turn. Since I'm already up and flying above everyone. Yep. Fly over here, lower myself. Mm -hmm. Walk five feet into the doorway. I can since okay. I can see them all. You are now blocking the doorway, though. Yes, I, I still have other movement. Okay. And it's gonna start tracking with fire, and I'm gonna send a firebolt at the farthest cultist. Okay. Uh, post it. Isn't firebolt to resist uh, a dexterity save? Um, no. check. I have it here. Um, 
Okay. Oh, it's an attack roll. Nope, just regular attack. Nine misses, unfortunately. I'm gonna take a step back and fly up above there. Okay, uh, he's flying. You guys can walk through his space without it being difficult terrain. Might get kicked in the head, though. The lizard is unhappy. <laughs> awesome. It is going to... make two tail attacks. It's going to make one tail attack. Holy. You okay, alas? You know, give me a second. I don't think I'm using the right salamander by the looks of it. What just happened? That does not look like a regular creature. That looks like it would be a, like a mini boss. Yeah, plus seven is a yikes. I mean, we did just fight two elementals in a similar fight and those it are... kind of looks like a crystal lizard kind of looks like a creature from Yu-Gi-Oh. can you get no you know the one thing ain't running. running off a cliff trying to get away from us yet <laughs> i mean when the ones from dark souls 3. yeah exactly the they run off cliffs no 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 i mean the big ones the giant ones the ones that attack you. What are you on about? Wasn't there, so I'm using, apparently I'm using the variant of the salamander that's standing up and, you know, has, like, a body. But wasn't there, like, a fire version of the frost salamander, which is just a lizard? Hmm? Doesn't matter. I guess, uh... More the fire snake. And I'll try fire snake. The frost one just change everything to fire damage instead. Well, for starters, the frost one is uh, CR9. Oh. What's this one's challenge rating? Five. Just, uh, no, this mm. is it. This is right. This is a regular fire salamander. Yeah, but it's like, it's the one that has like weapons and whatnot. Which is not the one that I wanted. I wanted the one that looks like a generic lizard. Okay, well, I guess you're fighting against a uh, 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 one that wields weapons. Lizard man. So you you are constrained. Uh, you're taking 15 plus 14 damage. Uh, and then he'll end his turn while constraining you. Sorry, how much time you need to make a DC 14 now? saving throw? Yeah, uh, for getting out of the grapple. I'm taking 15... 14, 29. And 14. Yep. Marim's turn. There's no longer as much space as there once was to get in the room. Uh, Mare can get to there. It's uh, through moving through... Uh, Token and Ricks. Yep. Uh, rogues can bonus action dash, yeah? Yep. Alright, she's gonna it. bonus action dash right to there. And uh, let's just stab that uh, cultist a couple times. <laughs> Lead for me, my precious. Uh, the first one misses. Dagger offhand. 23. That does hit. Sneak attack would apply. Allies within 5 feet. It's another 3. Does Merriman enter turn? Uh, yeah. Okay, Token, it's your turn. Uh, real quick, would a 13 yes. have hit? Because for some reason, he's rolling with strength on his short sword. Yes, a 13 would have hit, meaning you would have dealt the 9 damage. Meaning he's dead. Cultist down. 
Yeah, 27. Uh, the first one misses, but the second one, you definitely hit. I'm going to aim for its underbelly. You deal 11 damage, or you think you deal 11 damage. Hmm? Is there resistance uh, you were just using laughing. a regular longsword. Uh... A creature that touches the salamander or hits it with a melee attack while it's within five feet of it takes seven damage. You bitch. So he just took seven damage? And any metal melee weapon the salamander wields creates an... No, sorry, that's not what I wanted to read. Uh, so yeah, you just took seven damage for attacking it and hitting it once. Okay, now I have 52. Yep. Remember, you got all your health back from the long rest. I know. Yeah, 52, I have 59. My seven's 52. Rix, it is your turn. <sighs> well, I mean, you did make a bit of a mistake by giving me back my spell slots, but long rest, so Spirit Guardian. Uh, honestly, I don't think that's a mistake. <laughs> okay, uh, yep, yeah, Spirit Guardian. That happens. And 30 feet will get me there. So, both uh, of them make... It's blinding! Wisdom yeah, save. Wisdom. It's not blinding anymore. It's blinding to them. Uh, the salamander succeeds and the cultist fails. Uh, cultist will take 10, salamander will take 5. Okay. I cut myself when hitting the salamander. Uh, yeah, my turn is done. Awesome. Okay, so... With that, alas, it's your turn. Alas, you are constrained. You have to succeed in a DC 14 to break out of the constraint. Uh, DC 14 using what? Dexterity. Oh, yeah, like, this might be a minute. Or wait, no, was it strength? Might have sure been strength. 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 Yeah, strength. You fail, you are still constrained. Okay, can I attack it? Not while grappled. Okay, uh, I can't do anything, man. The target is restrained. Yeah, salamander can automatically like... hit the target with its tail, and the salamander can't make a tail attack against other creatures while you're grappled by it. But that's the cultist's turn. You little bitch, I'm going to get revenge for my good friend Michael. Which one was Michael? Uh, take my three damage and stick it up your bum. Which one's Michael? Good question. Which one was not Michael? <laughs> Think about it by this point. Aren't they all just like listing off full names and, and I am then talking going to... like Germans? And I'm using ignite on them. Uh. Well, he also how? had to make the wisdom save because his turn started. Oh no, my eyes—they they hurt. Yeah, slip track five. Uh, how does ignite work in this case? I'm pretty sure. He would still take half damage, and the total amount of damage taken. So he would just take four damage from it. Yeah, he was never hit by your fire. What? Oh. The one that was already dead. Yeah. Tori, it's now your turn. Okay, well, that's ignite, by the way. So you can use that to help. Um, and I will actually take the spell slot off because I just used that. Um. I will use Pina hmm. Colada. Okay. I'm going to um, look over at um, Merrim and say, "Hey, should I um, should I knock this guy unconscious for questioning?" Sure. Well, why not? Might as well do it. Uh. Okay, so. I forget exactly how sleep is, but seeing if as that's more that much points, I'm pretty... left, 
If he has that much health left, he's unconscious. Yeah, no, he's definitely asleep. <laughs> okay, nobody attack this guy. <laughs> Selfira, you are flying above the doorway. I'll bring myself down, move into here, and start flying up again. Okay. That's going to take you 5, 10, 15, 20, 20 feet of movement. Okay. Since I still have... How much movement would I have left while in the air? Uh, I would assume 20, unless your movement is 40. Thanks, so. I know I have... Yeah, I probably got 20 left. But... Yep. Look to his backside. Okay, you are flying above his backside. this point, I'll send two Eldritch Blasts down at his back. Okay. Roll the hit. Nine misses. Sixteen hits. For eight damage. Ah, pesky little things! Uh, a Spear Tag is going to be made at Rick's. Well, it starts its alone. turn, so saving throw first. Sure. I am trying to figure out what class this guy is. What class yeah, this guy is? The bird man. He's, he's, he's all classes, much bird. like you. I'm only two classes. Yeah, but one of your classes is basically every class. Uh, yeah, it fails. It takes the 17 damage. Well, I mean, I have used a uh, cantrip from every spellcasting class. Yeah, it's true. He has used the cantrip from every spell class casting class. Yeah, Eldritch oh, Blast is the one that confused me. But yeah, uh, he Eight. attacks you with the spear. Eighteen is a miss. Okay. Uh, and then he still uh, has the tail around. Uh, you know who? Uh, Twenty-three to hit. Uh, 18 damage to you, alas. Oh, what, sorry? You take Ooh, 18, sorry. uh, oh, sorry, 20 damage. Yep, I am down. You're down and still restrained in his tail. Marim's turn. She sees her baby daddy is down, and they can use their action. like a boa... Restrictor. Pretty sure Marum can actually use hit her action to um, grab one of the potions for me and pour it down his throat. If she wants. Uh, she could do that. Uh, she also knows that Rix has healing, so. Rix has healing, Rix has healing. Heal them, you motherfucker named Rix. <laughs> Lovely thing. Yeah, Rick. Uh, does she actually have second level slots, or is that just there? Because I think she does, doesn't she? Uh, she's well, level two. she should. Yes. Uh, second level favorite soul. Yeah. Yeah. Magic missile. Awesome. That's a just, second level, just... so it'll fire four of them. Okay, so four so times twelve three. damage total, all on the salamander. Ah, yeah, it's a stupid little bitch. It hurts. I don't know its accent. I just keep changing it. Oh, it hurts. Was that? It's Token's turn. Token, you got a big salamander in front of you. Hmm. Let me just scroll through my weapons list real quick to see what I have. Okay. I'm going to throw my spear. I'm going to throw one spear at it. Uh, that's two-handed. Okay, I'm going to still throw it. He's going to chuck it with both hands. <laughs> then I'm going to chuck the one-handed spear. Well, apparently that did more damage. <laughs> it had a better roll. <laughs> yeah, you chuck a spear into it. Uh, the spear pierces through his chest, but not dealing as much damage as it could. 
and the spear starts to burn and melt. Is this thing bloodied yet? Uh, yeah, there's blood. Yeah, but is it bloodied? Yeah, there's blood. Okay. Damn, my spear! No! Are both of them melted? You only threw one. <laughs> Uh, I actually threw two. One one hand at one and one two hand at one. No, you only throw the one one hand one. You still have a second attack. Hmm, what should I do with my second attack? You're gonna attack throw another spear at it. Guys, don't worry, I have a plan. Yeah, Strip, run away! <laughs> uh you throw a glaive at it. Uh, the I threw a glaive. Misses. I thought that was a javelin. That says glaive. The glaive misses and goes into the nearby wall. What the fuck is a glaive? It's like a spear with an axe as well. But how? Why haven't I been using that? That sounds well, cool. Well, a wall currently. <laughs> uh, maybe because it doesn't have the best stats. Oh, it's a one d ten. Actually, no. Yeah, why aren't you using a glaive? That sounds like something right up your alley. Because it's two-handed and he uses one-handed? Right, it's because you have a shield. I would just put my shield back and just throwing shit. Take this, you fiend! Throw like five bottles of dish soap. Yeah, anyways, <laughs> you miss with the glaive. Do you end your turn token? I do. Rix, it's your turn. Does your- the uh, the spell doesn't activate on- It turn. only starts on their turns. And when they enter. Right. Yeah. So, uh, I think I'm gonna, let's see. Uh, let's pull the uh, DC 14 was so. God damn it. Uh, do you end your turn, Rix? Uh, Mm, hold on. That would take an action, so, uh... Oh, apparently slumber affects multiple yep, things. Yep, that's my turn done. Potentially. Yeah, okay. Feet, 20 feet of the area I choose for, I didn't choose any area. Unless you were unconscious, roll a life or death saving throw. Yep. And pray for death to be quick. Oh. One death out of three. You're all right, potentially halfway there to dying. Uh, the cultist, would the cultist, while unconscious, still be affected by your uh, ring of death? They're not affected. Uh, it would, yes. Oh, then you just well, pulled him up. Yeah. I probably just killed him. He automatically fails. So, roll the damage. Oh yeah, that would cause us an auto crit as well. Yeah, you're right. Well, I can't crit with wisdom saves. Fair so. point. Ugh, he wakes up lying on the ground, stands up and tries to stab you, Tori. Wouldn't he just roll 3d8 as well for his crit? I can't crit with a wisdom save. Oh yeah, whatever. Okay. Uh, okay, okay roll. I need to pull up his character sheet because I forgot about that, so... Both miss. Okay, then I can't use Hellish Rebuke then? Nope. Uh, with that, Tori, it's your turn. Okay. Um, my plan was to keep him unconscious, so that's at a table for what I was going to plan. Unless I can get him distracted and attack someone else. How about you just kill him already? Okay. You could beat him to sleep. 
You could intentionally get him below his hit points and then say, uh, I'm non-lethal damaging him. Though I recommend you get him out of the goddamn ring if you're gonna do that, because he's gonna die afterwards anyways. Yeah, uh, unless I specify for something to not be targeted by it, it will target literally anything. It did not let me choose extra things. I was gonna add more levels to it. Uh, how many cast at a first level? Uh, I'm going to be adding another level to it, so to add another, it would add another bolt to it. Uh, no, wasn't it more than one bolt gets added? Uh, it so adds it, one that... bolt per level, and it shoots three at first. So I'm looking Over. for so uh, eight damage. All, all at. All at him. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> It was non-lethal damage. You, you cast a magic missile. The spell. <laughs> no, he's dead. You're supposed okay, to I'm slap checking... him asleep. No, I'm your turn's done. To... You just killed him like an idiot. No, I'm checking this in quickly. Um, I'm checking to see how I use arcane recovery. Let me take For... action. So I can get a spell slot back. Oh, okay. Sulfira! Okay, I have a second level spell slot back then. Wasn't that- didn't you say that would- that would take an action? I'm not sure, it doesn't say anywhere. It says, per short rest. Oh, okay. Once per day, <laughs> when you finish a short rest, you can choose to expend okay. spell slots to recover. <laughs> it doesn't get you slots back. It it's the other way them. around. You use magic to heal instead of die. Uh, so here, you are still flying five feet uh, above the rear end of the salamander. She's enjoying it. Who? And he. I keep getting confused by the name. No, wait, I'm yeah, I, I gain brain. a spell slot back when I use it. No. Nope. You can use expended spell slots to recover. Ye the spell slots can be combined level that is equal to or less than half your wizard level, rounded up, and none of the slots can be six level or higher. Right, no, well, I missed still only in short it, rest. You can choose expended, but yes, it has to be a short rest. Not yeah, I get that part. I got that part. He said that I would cover health from it, though. That's not what happens. Doesn't matter. It's not going to happen today, because once this fight's done, we're done for the day, because we've got, like, less than a minute left. Hmm. Uh, so, Sephira, what do you do? I'm going to cast Vicious Mockery. I've heard of arrows in the knee, but not spears in the spleen. Uh, okay. Wisdom save, right? He passes. I'll put an arrow in your spleen. Or, sorry, uh, spear. Okay, do you end your turn? Can I fly up higher? Uh, yeah, you can fly five feet up higher. I'll do that. Okay. He turns around. Boy, you don't know a thing about spear. Reach. And he, uh, he drops, uh, I'm assuming that hits. It does. Uh, you take, you take 15 damage, three of it being fire. Uh, and then Token, he's going to drop, uh, Alas on the ground and tail whip Token. And miss? Yep. Oh, shit. I forgot again, didn't I? I just grab his tail in midair and just walk and just, uh, throw it away. No, you just hit it off of your shield. Miram's turn. I need to remember that more. <laughs> right, okay. He saves, so half damage. It's a five. Y yeah. You know that, but you don't know the square root of what was it? <laughs> 547. Liam? 
All right. Yeah. Uh, What's the square root of 557? How should I know? <laughs> uh, Marion's just gonna short bow. Okay. 23 hits for 12. Uh, and sneak attack is applied. Right there. Okay. With that token, it's back to your turn. Okay. I lost my one-handed spear. You've lost a spear. Uh, you've chucked a glaive. Could just take the damage. I mean, it's it's don't ooh. Oh, the hand, hand axe. Okay, the hand axe hits, uh, and you take the seven damage. I thought I chucked it. Yeah, but you're still five feet in front of him. You're chucking it right in front of you. Yes. And then I use the long sword. Uh, with that, uh, okay, you attack with a long sword. You take another seven damage. And Rix, it's your turn. Uh, okay, Alas is down, so... Cure Wounds, first level. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, Alas 14 health. is up. Yep. Do you end your turn, Rix? Uh, yep. Alas, you are prone. Okay, I'm gonna stand up. Mm -hmm. And I'm just gonna whack it with my staff. Whack it with your stick. Whack it with your stick! I'm gonna whack, whack it with your my dick. big old stick. You miss. I'm gonna attempt to whack it again. You hit. Yay. Ow! That hurts! How dare you whack me with your stick? Eek. I take 7 Do damage, right? Eek. Yeah, you take 7 damage in the process of that. And I end my turn. Tori, it's your turn. Okay. I am going to use... Acid. What? You have acid vials. Right! How do oh I keep forgetting God. that? Because you're dumb. <laughs> every time. Yeah, every time though, seriously. How do I keep forgetting that? Because you're dumb. <laughs> Rick's be smarter than you! Ooh. Okay, there's three, so... Yeah, you can make it. I know, I'm just trying to calculate where I could throw it so it doesn't hit everybody else. Yeah, I'll throw it right here. Sail, you could throw it under Stale. She's flying 15 feet in the air. So I can just throw it here. It won't hit anybody. I really uh, creature. Okay. So, what was that? A dexterity save? Yep. Uh, unfortunately, saved. Sail, kill it already. Yes, I know spears have reach, and I'm gonna send T Waldrich Blast down at it. Okay. Miss hit. You kill it. Now. The Eldritch Blast impacts with its head, causing a dentin, a cave in of its forehead, and it falls over dead. Is the turn order done? Uh yeah, it's this is done. You guys got uh how much is a cultist worth? Oh wow. 
I'm using it on the salamander. <laughs> you got 2700 XP. Large. Uh, oh, then I'll use it on the cultist. How much was it? Uh, 2700 XP. Okay, divided by six. Each way except 450. Each. Yeah, 450 each. Boom. All right, uh, you just brought that back as a zombie right in front of Rix. Uh, Rix turns on you and uh, <coughs> he hisses quite angrily and says, no, <laughs> bad. And then he Wait. channeled divinities and destroys the dead. Hold on, no, no, hold on. I'm going to do something before you do that. Hold on. Before you actually did that. <laughs> Where was it? Uh... It's not dead. It's not undead. He's still gonna do it. <laughs> but I lied to him saying it's not undead. I'm going to hold him to back. To be sure. I'm going to hold him back. And then he casts Destroy Undead. <laughs> And he destroys your undead. That's Damn it me. for today, guys. I'm gonna quickly use the washroom, grab something to eat, and then I'm gonna run off to play Minecraft because everybody's asking me to do that. I'll be back in a minute. Jared, join me in the other chat. <laughs> oh, guys, Why couldn't Rick be one of the ones that are fine with the undead? Trying to go find someone. Right. Wait, you've met undead before. You've met an undead skeleton. Doesn't mean he likes them. When was this? In the keep? Am I thinking of a different campaign? Yeah? Oh, I'm thinking of the other one. Rix, uh. is, uh, Rix is very much anti-undead. He's, he's a life cleric. You're, you're thinking mean... of, uh, of Cole. See you guys later. I mean, technically speaking, I got it back to life. <laughs>